Hey guys, what is up? It's your girl Chelsea J and I'm back with another video. To all of my new subscribers, thank you so much for subscribing. And to all of my ODV goodies, hey boo, what it do? Welcome back. Alright y'all, so this is another SAS haul. I did push a few online orders and they're taking forever to come in. Just to let y'all know, it is technically Friday the 17th and I still have not received my <clears throat> early access order. So it was supposed to get here today. It was supposed to get here today. I checked the shipping all throughout the day and then finally it said it's gonna be delivered tomorrow. So we'll see. Um, <clears throat> so some of the items in this haul, may not make sense because you're probably like girl why did you buy that and you don't have that's because the pieces are kind of like hit and miss and when i get there i will explain to you why something is tickling my throat and i think it's these fragrances but okay guys so these were two separate orders and i was gonna make them two like a video per order but um it's taking a little bit for this first order stuff to get here the last few pieces so i'll just include that in another one and we make it do what it do so i do have two boxes right here i'm gonna try to clip it up without showing y'all any personal information i hope this I'm trying to get a thumbnail but yeah i have two boxes right here and so we are going to jump into the first box and let me go ahead and say y'all that i have pretty much gotten my price adjustments all of these things were actually 75 percent off that i got in this order so um no price adjustments there if it's like three dollars four dollars sometimes i kind of leave it and i'll tell you why in a little bit but everything in this order was 75 percent off so first up i got two of the fireside flurries y'all the notes are toasted marshmallow pink lavender cashmere woods let me say that when this scent came out last sas i slept on it i slept on it so hard because i'm not a lavender girl for real but oh my god in this i just get so much of the marshmallow that that lavender doesn't even matter to me <clears throat> so last year sas i picked up like three or four shower gels i think i picked up three and then my husband was like oh i like that scent too i'm gonna use it too so i went ahead and picked up another one so i know we already used up one and so either we have two or three left so I just went ahead and grabbed the spray because I was like, oh my God. I just, I totally slept on this. So if you slept on this last SAS and you can find it this SAS, pick it up and at least spray it and give it a try because I slept on it and I kind of regret sleeping on it, but now I have it, so I'm fine. I'm hoping that they do bring it back for next SAS because for me this is a nighttime sleep nighttime sleep <laughs> nighttime scent because it is very calming so yeah that's fireside flurries <clears throat> the next thing I picked up was a fairy tale body butter um body cream sorry it's pomegranate nectar fresh orange blossom vanilla bean warm amber I have a spray and a lotion <clears throat> And y'all, this smells so good. This pairs well with YSL Libre. And since I had the lotion, I decided I wanted to give the cream a go. Um, y'all know the lotions last longer. So um, this is kind of like my backup. That's what I'm going to start doing, I think. Buying a cream and buying a lotion. But y'all know I'm not a big cream girl. I love my lotions because they just last longer and i don't have to worry about them going bad <clears throat> but i'm gonna start using these and then kind of just put my lotion to the back burner because it can last and i heard a rumor a rumor about this going away i think everybody thought that this is going away because um they saw it like they saw the perfumes for 75 percent off which i need I, i'm praying i get my hands on and then they saw this on sale but i think um 
I know they're reformulating the body cream, so I'm thinking that's why this is on sale. Now, why the perfume is on sale, I don't know. Maybe they're redesigning the package, but I thought this was going to be a part of the core line. I love this. I love layering this with YSL Libre. I know y'all already heard it before. This is good, good. <laughs> good, good. Like I'm seeing a Maria or something, but this is good. Get your hands on it. <clears throat> and last but not least, I picked up a set to a scent that I don't remember if I had back in the day, but if I did, I don't remember it. And that is Hello Beautiful and i got the fragrance mist and i got the body cream and the notes are white gardenia jasmine petals magnolia blossom pink nectarine cotton musk yeah this is nice and clean and floral floral i could see myself wearing this when i want a nice clean scent but also when i want like um a little pop to it if that makes sense and this was 75 percent off as well i'm trying to think if i ever had this before back in the day <clears throat> i don't know but i got it now because it was 75 percent off and i was just like the packaging is pretty but that's not why i bought it i bought it because i was curious to smell it and see if i had this back in the day because i know for a fact i had beautiful day back in the day but not sure about this all right next up you guys we're gonna go into the second box because i need to get this stuff put up <laughs> this box is all over my house so <clears throat> a lot of this stuff i got a price adjustment for or i'm gonna pray that it's within my 14 days and i can get a price adjustment for it all right so first up the first set we have is a back up and y'all knew i was gonna do it vanilla confetti sparkle i always get it messed up because i want to say confetti cake pop but creamy cake frosting rainbow sprinkles vanilla bean i had to get it back up your girl found herself <clears throat> holding herself back from using her first set because i was just like y'all was scaring me y'all was saying oh i can't find it in my store it's none on the shelves which is true because when i went to my store they only had one spray and no, none of the creams so i was like oh shoot and i definitely regretted um <clears throat> sleeping on confetti cake pop well not sleeping on it i was only able to find a lotion and i used that up a while ago so i was like if i can get my hand on a backup set then i'm definitely definitely gonna go ahead and allow myself the freedom to use that other one Y'all, this smells so good. This has me in a chokehold, for real, for real. The only thing is, the I found out that the confetti cake pop, this cream, went bad. Not bad, but it started turning kind of quick. But I think that's because it has vanilla bean in it and it's so heavy on the vanillas. So, we gonna see. We, we, we gonna see. I feel like I can take a deep breath now because... I got it out the way, but this is one of the ones that I paid 50% off for and I'm waiting for my price adjustment. So let's just hope I can get a price adjustment. If I don't, <clears throat> I won't be mad, but I am hoping that I can get a price adjustment. The next set that I actually got is Sunkist from the, what is this line called? California 11, I think, something like that. So, sun-drenched orange blossom, sparkling sea salt, vanilla breeze. Let me tell you, if it's two notes that Bath & Body Works is gonna put in a scent, it's gonna definitely be sparkling sea salt or sea salt and vanilla breeze. This smells like, I heard somebody say it smells like sun, what the heck, hell? I heard somebody say it smells like Suntan lotion, but I ain't getting that. I get it. It definitely smells like something I have already, so I probably could have waited. But I already got my price adjustment for this down to four ninety five. I could, if I had waited till today, I would have got my price adjustment to three ninety five or three whatever. But I price adjusted yesterday and. She was like, you can only price adjust on items one time. So I don't know if y'all knew that, but once you price adjust on an item, 
you can't price adjust it price adjust it again so my thoughts and a tip that i have for you guys is a wait as close to your 14 days as you can before you price adjustment price adjust it so that's what i'll be doing for if any of the um like your vanilla confetti sparkle goes on sale i'll be waiting because if it goes to like 4.95 i'm gonna wait to see if it hits 75 percent off I don't know if that line is ever going to hit 75%. I was going to just say that because you can barely find it. Yeah, this smells like something I had before. Mm, my allergies are kind of messing up too. Um, but I think I'm going to play off of the orange blossom in this. So, yeah. Um, actually, let me put this one over here. And let me put this hello beautiful over here because this is gonna go into my cart because on my little cart right now i have like all my spring and summer scents all right next up we have another part of that california love line and summertime surf um vanilla breeze told y'all <laughs> sea salt sands told y'all <laughs> creepy coconut that vanilla breeze and that sea salt has Bath and Body Works. I can't wear the same Victoria's Secret. Bath and Body Works in a choke hole. But I already have the spray to this, so I decided to grab the lotion. It's just a coconut beachy scent. Y'all already know the vibes with that. I wear coconut any time of the year, so it is what it is. If it got coconut in it, I'm wearing it whenever. Um, let me put this to the side so I can add this with my premise. All right, last three things, you guys, and yeah. So the first thing we're gonna jump into is this orange vanilla twist. Y'all know everybody's been going crazy over this juicy orange summer sherbet vanilla cream. I heard somebody ask, say they didn't know what sherbet was, and it's just ice cream. It's just ice cream. Um, in my experience, like orange and green and then sometimes pink and it's pretty good um yeah so let me smell this so spoiler alert the spray is on the way um but if y'all notice they just put the lotions online maybe like one or two days ago so yeah in this lotion i get nothing but orange a little bit of that sherbet Trying to see how I smell on my skin. Cause I'm getting hella orange. Which is not a bad thing. It smells just like a dream sickle, cream sickle situation. A minute. I I'm gonna have to try this on clean skin. It's not bad or anything, but I have on uh Trader Joe's Brazil nut butter today, and I think that this is mixing in with that a little bit. But <clears throat> so far on my skin, I get a lot of orange. I let my husband smell this, and um, he was just like, "Okay." <laughs> I don't know if he didn't really say if he liked it or not. And so the next lotion that I picked up in that same collection i picked up two is the cinnamon donut swirl it has notes of sweet cinnamon brown sugar fluffy dough i picked up two because everybody was saying how good this is um i did not pick up a shower gel because my skin excuse me my skin is starting to not like bath and body work shower gels so once I work through the ones that I had, I probably won't be purchasing any more shower gels. And I actually need to check out my <clears throat> moisturizing body washes and see how my skin acts to that. So, like I said, sweet cinnamon, brown sugar, and fluffy dough. My husband actually liked this one. This one smells sweeter than what I thought it was going to smell like. Y'all, I'm going to mix this with, since it's right here and I don't have lotion to it. I'm going to mix this with cotton candy apple. I don't even know if that's going to smell good together. But I'm kind of thinking on the terms of an apple fritter. I saw Jasmine Bullard um, talk about an apple fritter. Let's see. Not bad, not bad. Um, let me see how this plays out on my skin. 
Just a little bit. Oh, y'all, that's so good. It is good on my skin. I smell the dough and I smell. Oh, man, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I'm just gonna layer it on top and see what I'm gonna get. Because this might hit for a nice ball set. We will see. Oh, y'all, that's good, actually. Hmm, okay. So, you might be seeing this in my fall layering combo. Um, yeah, that's actually good, y'all. So, this is good. Um, I do want to get a price adjustment on it. Like I said, I have two. <clears throat> this, I feel like, is going to be the same as Bubblegum Pop for me. This is going to be like a good layering agent. For real. I don't know if I even want to wear this right now because, you know. And I also don't know if I want to get rid of these bottles because I feel like once this is gone, it's going to be gone. And I want to keep some for nostalgia purposes. But yeah, y'all, so... I'm on, I'm on to something. I'm on to something. Okay. It worked. How it worked in my head is how it worked out. <laughs> so, yeah, y'all. That is it for this haul. Thank you all so much for watching. If you have not already, go ahead and click that subscribe button down below. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Peace.